Well, folks, a pleasant, good evening. This is Cool TV, and we are coming to you live from the Robert International Airport. His Excellency Joseph Nyuma Buakai just touched down Liberia from Atlanta, Georgia, after attending the Black Anwar National Conference in the United States of America. Mm -hmm. The president mm -hmm. and his delegates just arrived in Asuka Airline recently, as you can see from our camera. And so be with us as we bring you this So Jay Sabato, we are one of our regular followers on Cool TV. Welcome. So well, the president just arrived. Uh, Please share the live broadcast. I'll be bringing part of the update here today. On arrival of his excellency, to Jesus Mabraka. So keep to <laughs> While the president was in the United States, he visited uh, several parts of Alanja, Georgia, meeting with black business tycoons, discussing Liberia's economy and to see the betterment of the country. And finally, he has returned back to the country. Uh, and we will question the president about these developments. Well, be with us. So we are trying to make our way to the terminal and and we are trying to make our way
And the convoy of His Excellency Joseph Nimbuakai, they are coming to pick the president up. But uh, we were told to go in, in the terminal and we are now leaving. So we still with the just get a signal, we will try to go in. But recently the president just arrived from the United States of America after attending the Black Business Conference in Atlanta, Georgia, discussing with high delegates, business tycoons. So folks, be with us. of some of the issues that His Excellency President Walker spoke about. And uh, I'm, my, my colleague from Cool FM is right by me and um, I'm hoping we can talk about some of the things that were spoken about in the U.S. by His Excellency. Tio, do you want us to do a joint conversation? I know you are also on your own live, but I wouldn't mind if we both can do a joint conversation. His Excellency has just arrived, as you can see. Uh, we will disembark the flight any moment from now. But um, while in the U.S., uh, President Boakai attended several meetings, he attended some press conferences, and there were some uh, special issues discussed. I mean, on top of his list, he kept encouraging investors to invest in Liberia, especially the agricultural sector. But let's hear from you. Um, the president was in the United States attending the Black Business Conference, and uh, one of the key uh, one of the key issues that was put for uh, in that uh, conference uh, with uh, discussing with business that called was the, the, the agriculture sector. Yes, yes, he's discussed more about the agriculture sector, but I think I will go ahead. Yes, he will better explain to us about what he discussed earlier. All right, so we have been getting the Chief Terrence. Presidential aid and all of people who have come to uh, receive the president.
also the president and Dr. his delegates. There you have the president. Welcome the president. The presidential press secretary and Amma. Honorable <laughs> Kumi, welcome to Liberia. How was the trip? You was on the you was on the you was on the flat with the president. How was just by coincidence? Oh, just by coincidence. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so the standard barrier of the ANC Alexander Cummins uh, in, uh, in said he was on the flight with the president by in coincidence so so folks but uh, we will listen to the president the good news he brought for Liberians So Alexander Gomez was with the president in the same flight by coincidence according to him. And Sylvester Grisby, the Minister of State, mm -hmm. has taken his position to welcome the President, His Excellency Joseph Numa Borkai. <laughs> yeah, no, so the Minister of State takes his position to welcome the President. Uh, members of the armed forces of Liberia uh, taking their position taking their position to welcome the president giving him his respect back in the country
So there you have the president, His Excellency Joseph Nyumabuakai. And there you have it. There you have it, His Excellency. <laughs> So So So, folks, uh, be with us. Uh, the presidential press secretary will shortly speak to us. Uh, speak to us uh, about the president's trip to the United States, uh, Atlanta, respectively, attending the Black Business Conference. Uh, more things were discussed uh, among uh, black business tycoons residing in the United States and other parts of the world. But the press secretary will give us more details. We don't want to jump into the discussion. But be with us, folks. Why the USA, he made and you know, uh, the president visited uh, uh, other universities in the United States. And...
So the president actually, just for the me. president actually called um, global black business leaders to seize investment opportunities in Liberia. He also stressed the need of Liberia's readiness for foreign investment. So, folks, uh, we stay with the presidential press secretary, Kula Fufana, who will brief out, brief us just ahead of the president's official. Uh, welcoming statement. And you know that the president visited uh, other parts of Atlanta as part of his visit. As a matter of fact, it was the president's second visit to the United States of America. Organizational CEOs who are potential enough of investing in Liberia. But what is that specific agreement that has the president you know, has made? Once he comes out, I'm sure the president will be and talking to the media and you know, breaking the news that. The one year 24 National Black Business Conference, the, the president said Liberia is open for business. All right. And he probably went on black investors in the United States to come back to Liberia and be able to invest, create job opportunities for Liberia. I think here the president in one of his one of his engagements uh, talking about the, the reason why we have power tech in Liberia. The president put it that uh, okay. there are shortage of electricity. So folks uh, be with us uh, very very shortly the presidential press secretary Kula Fufana will definitely speak to us and tell us more about the president's trip so you don't need to go be with us share the live broadcast to other platforms um, gave us gave us the benefit that you will share just comment uh, what you expect from the president on his recent visit from the United States other questions will be asked uh, while the president was away uh, there was a tussle between the police and the CDC partisans and we will ask him uh, about said riot so folks be with us as we take you through um, the desire of coming to Liberia to come why assuring them that uh, their business will be safe, well protected. So those who actually attended those who attended the, the black conference in Atlanta include uh, Dr. Ken Harris, President and CEO of the National Business League. Uh, the former minister of the World Conference of New York, Ron Rosby, uh, who is President of the National Black Chamber of Commerce, and Charles H. Bingo. The third, who is the CEO of the National Black Chamber of Commerce. All of those individuals attended the Mondial 24th National Black Conference in Atlanta. 
Potential leaders, business leaders specifically, they attended the conference. And the president making Liberia's case at a conference. And so, folks, just to give you. <laughs> Dignitaries who've traveled with the president are also here. Hmm. See the presence of. Uh, Maureen, she just arrived. So the president was in Atlanta attending the Black Business Tech, uh, Conference, uh, arranges Liberia's economy, development, and prospects to black business tycoons. And he also called on global business leaders to seize investment opportunities in Liberia, you know what that means? Stressing the nation's readiness for foreign investments. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. During the president's keynote speech at the Black Business Conference, the president outlined immense prospects in Liberia's agriculture mining and infrastructure, energy and real estate sectors as pillar for future economic growth. And the president said to his fellow colleagues during the conference that Liberia is open for business and is ready to welcome investments and investors in Liberia. The president also urged black business leaders to recognize Liberia's potential as a hope for sustainable and development and invited them to take part in the country's progress. And quoting what the president said, he said there is no there is great potential for value-added industries like steel production and mineral processing which will minimize the economic benefits of natural resources. So these are things and questions that we will ask the president. But one of the questions, the president was away while uh, a toss up between the LNP and the, the partisans of CDC. But we will question His Excellency concerning that. Black Business Conference 
So, just a minute from now, the press secretary will of Liberia is coming out of the Yabi launch. Mr. President, welcome back to Liberia. Thank you. Tell, firstly, tell us how was the trip, Mr. President. Very, very good. Okay. You visited some universities in the United States. What's the good news, Mr. President? The first thing is that the purpose of the trip was that I was invited to be keynote speaker at the Black Business Black Businesses. I have an organization, a conference, so they invited me to be the keynote speaker. And of course, part of our effort for education was to go to a black university, make arrangements for student exchange program as well as faculty exchange okay. for them to work with us okay. to strengthen our educational system. Okay. So, uh, my name is Master Talwa from EOBC. So, uh, from all of these engagements, how, how so uh, Liberia maybe tend to see some uh, tangibles from these engagements? Well, uh, when we do these things, we follow up. When we are followed up. Yeah, I'm sure to see them here. And I'm sure they too, but they visit the American so They're happy. Okay, thank you, Mr. President. Thank you very much. Have a nice so, that was, that, that, that was that the voice of the President of the Republic of Liberia. And then, the meeting was the Thanks, America. I'm going to follow this conference. Come back to the We'll be having a So folks, thanks for watching. My name is Daniel Teofilos Cole. I've been here at the Robots International Airport. Thanks. This is Cool FM.